as you continue to do voiceover work and you start gaining clients and, you know, you're making money, you're invoicing your clients and they're paying you, you know, in net 14 or net 30 days or whatever it is, or they pay you right away. Um, you want to make sure that you're being very organized with um, how much each client is paying you because those rates might be different. Um, you want to make sure that in your invoices, your your descriptions are accurate. The titles and descriptions are accurate, right? So it should be the job and it should be whatever episode or whatever version that you worked on and the price for that, right? It should be it should be really specific. So later on down the line, you don't want to be sending your client an email talking about, did you pay me for this already? And now they're like, oh, really? We like you can't keep like things in order, whether or not we paid you. And God forbid, they're like, we we paid this guy for those three and he's invoicing us again. Right. Or billing us again. So it's very important because it, it can ruin a relationship and you can be doing a great job with your your voiceover work, but it can ruin the relationship. So. Please try to keep track of who you invoiced already, who who um still is due to pay you, right? That should all happen automatically in your um billing software. But make sure that you are, you know, when these jobs come in and you work, go right to your software and put down that you worked on exactly what you worked on. Okay?